Hello, Millie Vanilli fans. I'm Kevin Ripa, and this is My Sans 3 Minutes Max. Today, we're going to look at lies my computer told me in terms of files that I should be able to see, but I don't see, so I think they don't exist, and I may mess up an investigation doing so. Uh, we're going to use FTK Imager for this demonstration, and so I've got FTK Imager open here, and I'm going to uh, mount an evidence file, file system read only. I'm going to mount that to give it a drive letter. And uh, I now have that, and I'm going to uh, minimize that so that I can get into my examination. Now, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up, I'm going to go to the directory that I just created. And uh, you can see that where we're going to go is fairly deep down the Windows uh, file path. We're going to go into the Donald user and we're going to go to app data. Everything that you see now is considered a hidden file or a hidden directory or file. In other words, unless you've specifically taken measures to have your computer view hidden system files and folders and other files and folders, uh, you won't be able to see anything that you see here. So in this case, we see that we have only one shortcut. But I don't really trust that. I, I think that that's wrong. Now, if you believe this, you're going to go on your merry way and say, this guy's done some anti-forensics. There should be link files in here. If you don't know what a link file is, go to a previous episode. We talked about them. But you're going to walk away thinking, there's nothing here. Well, let's drop down to CMD in the way that I showed you in a previous episode. We're dropping to that file path, and I'm going to do a directory to see what's in there. Well, clearly there's something in there. Wait a minute. There was one thing there. There's a whole bunch of things there. So which is it? Why does it look the way that it looks? Well, let's see if we can explain that. I'm going to go in here and I'm going to do a dir on just one file. We see the confidential analysis data. There's three files there. How can that be? Because Windows doesn't allow three files of the same name in the same directory, not even two. So what is the issue here? Well, in order to fully understand this, let's go back and look at what we see here forensically. We go drill down into the directory with the image file mounted, and we see that in the recent directory, we've got one, we've got two, we've got three files by the same name. How? This is deleted. That's deleted. FTK Imager is able to look at the MFT and show us these files, but Windows could not do that. So because it couldn't figure out how to show it to us, it didn't show us anything. If you are unaware of this, if you don't look for these pitfalls, if you don't verify by dropping to the command line and looking in that same directory for contents, you're going to miss incredibly valuable information. In the meantime, in between time, that's it. Another episode of 3 Minutes Max.